Good morning, Hope Church. I'm excited to share an update with you today. We work with university students in a large Middle Eastern city. Our goal is to build movements of Christians where disciples of Christ raise up more disciples so that everyone has an opportunity to hear and respond to the gospel. Of the 80 million people living in our country, less than 10,000 are known to follow Christ. Most follow the religion of Islam. But this is not a place without hope, as we trust what scripture says in Revelation chapter 7 verse 9, that when Christ returns there will be a great multitude that no one can count, from every nation, tribe, people, and language, standing before the throne and before the Lamb. God is calling people from this country to be part of his kingdom, and we have seen evidence of God working here. Because of COVID, the universities have been conducting classes online, so we have had to get creative about ways to connect with students. Our team started several virtual English clubs and an Instagram page, where each week students interact about scripture and spiritual questions. We've also been able to have small groups into our homes, and on Good Friday, we shared our family tradition of eating lamb to remember the Passover with a student named John. John has distanced himself from Islam, the religion of his family. He shared how he is disgusted with the violence he sees and how he has learned a bit about Christianity. Together we read the story of the Last Supper and understood how Jesus is the last sacrifice ever needed for our sin. John's understanding of Christ is growing and there are so many more students like him, those who are disillusioned with the falsehoods of what they know, but with no truth to turn to. Please continue to pray for great revelations of truth and opening of hearts for John and others as we share Christ in this country. Thank you so much for your support.